What's up ladies and gentlemen? So here we are. Uh, we are at the diner. This is going to be part five. Let me put my headphones on real quick. And by the way, this is Jeremy coming back at you with a little transit strategy. So what we're going to do is we're going to open this door and we are going to purchase Speed Cola. So now we got Speed Cola, we have Juggernog, Nog, and we have Re Quick Revive and two weapons fully maxed out on ammo. So unfortunately we're going to need the uh, to have the bus come back around and get us. Uh, I wonder if we can make a a portal or a portal a uh, what's it called? Um, let's see if we can. Hmm. Now how do they make those um, portal things? I forgot how it's done. Oh well. That's not what this tutorial is about. Our strategy guide. I wonder if we could train here real quick and get some points up. Might be a little dangerous. Uh, I'm thinking we might be able to last one round at least. I don't know. It's pretty risky. I kind of want to go back to the um, under the you know the overpass location. Because we, uh, we need to get Tombstone at the power location, which is after the farm. Stamina up, stamina up is at the farm. Alright, well. We're about to kill some zombies. So it's round nine. We have Quick Revive, Juggernog, and Speed Cola. So now we're going to train here, get a crawler. Hopefully the bus comes back around and then we can buy some more stuff. Really, dude? Oh my gosh, look at all those crawlers. Should have reloaded, didn't have time. That's amazing, all those crawlers. Oh, did you see that? Did y'all just see that? I just got the double headshot. And it said I knew I knew that was there all along. So we just completed the headshot thing. Wow. It just you just it was just like a a green puff above their head. So I'm not sure what that exactly means. But I was watching a video on YouTube a while ago, or today, or yesterday, and it said something about how you get the double headshot and you, that little green thing above their head gets. Um, okay, I, is it this? Maybe it's the lock-on thing. I'm going to have to look into that and see what it is.
I wish they'd get away from each other. Why are they stuck together? Well, one of them died. We don't want to mess with those. So we've got 6,000 points. We have enough for... Um, what, Tombstone or Stamina Up? I'm not sure. I think... Well, here's the bus again. Alright guys, we're going to take off in this thing. Let's go, bro. That headshot thing's awesome, though. I have to go back and look and see what that exactly does for you. I know it saves some part in transit. Those dudes are going to get ran over. Come over here, boys. Come over here. Come over here. Don't get ran over. Man! Get away from me. There we go, guys. I hope they don't die. And they did. That sucks. Well, we might have to train at the farm, unfortunately. There's the power, dude. Man, get off me. Pissing me off, man. I'm about to knife him again. Screw you, dude. Trying to get me killed. I don't want that. Where is he? There he is. Knife his ass again. Alright, dude. Don't knife the crawler. I'm almost down. Alright guys, we're going to go up here and buy a double tap. Strategy is taking a life of his own. Alright, so it's round 11. We have Jug, Quick Revive, Speed Cola, and Double Tap. So now all we need is Stamina Up. Let's kill this dude. Get away from me. Go back to your home. Thank you. Let's open this up. Let's see. Uh, let's get Claymores right here. Man. Alright, so what do we drop? What do we drop? The the ladder? All right. I think the, we're going to try to put the ladder on when the bus comes back. And then we are going to go grab the other part for the top of it, or for the the cow catcher. 
All right, so there he is. I think he's leaving, though. And they just died. Man, why can't I put it on, man? Man, don't leave me. Jesus Christ. Well, now we're in a really crappy situation. This thing's on us. Zombies are coming. That pisses me off. This game's so stupid sometimes. Stupid fire. Man, That's how you mow down zombies right there, ladies and gentlemen. Let's see, do we still have a crawler? I don't think that did anything, did it? There we go. Alright, so we've got... <laughs> we've got 12,220 points. A crawling zombie. We've got our four perks. All we need is um, stamina and tombstone, and we'll have all of them. Yeah, but right now, we just need the bus to come back around so we can put the ladder on and then take off to the power location. <laughs> So yeah, we're set up. It's round 12 and we are pretty set up right now. We need to get that ladder on the bus though. So, what can we repair? Well, we got carpenter so everything's repaired. Don't think there's anything up there. Let's make sure. And that doesn't open the door to that. But I think we got the only perk here, so it doesn't really matter. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, that is going to be it for my transit strategy. I hope that it is very beneficial and helpful for you. I think it will be. We are sitting at round 12. We have Quick Revive, we have Juggernog, we have Speed Cola, and we have Double Tap. Uh, we've got some claymores, we have the ladder for the bus, <clears throat> we have our um, turbine to power things, and we're sitting pretty with, you know, 12,222 points. So what you could do next is, you know, you could go to the town, and I think you could get, uh, I think Tombstone or Stamina's there, either one of those. But uh, what I would do after this is I'd go after... You know, probably tombstone, so you can cup, so you won't lose all your perks if you go down. That might be. I'd probably get that and then stamina up. Uh, stamina up's good for if you're running across the map or whatever. But you know, I, I'd go for um, um, tombstone. And what tombstone does is when you die, or you know, when you die with quick revive, they'll uh, they'll be like a little like a little drop at the last place at the place you died or whatever so if you kind of 
kind of crawl over to the side or whatever you'll get quick revived and then there'll be a drop and you can pick it right back up and you still have your perks and uh your gun so you know that's pretty awesome to keep that stuff because it sucks having to that's you know a very important perk to get because it really sucks having to go down with quick or you know to go down and then have to run around on the bus or on the map and go get jug and speed call and double tap all over again you know that would just suck but it happens and i've done it and uh but yeah this just right here you're sitting pretty the claymores are really really uh powerful in this game so if you drop two claymores if you're in trouble or whatever they will you know annihilate some zombies anyway i hope you did enjoy this and uh i had fun making it um i'm probably gonna i'm probably gonna do like uh some more videos on zombies i'm not sure what uh, I'm going to go after some high rounds pretty soon. Uh, probably uh, make a video on how to build the perk station on transit. And I definitely want to do the stories. Uh, Rick, uh, <clears throat> uh, Dr. Maxis and Rick Toffin, um, I want to do there. They, I want to do those stories because I haven't done them because I've just been trying to do high rounds and, you know, play with randoms. I've played some um, Grief well, a game of grief, which is pretty fun. It just takes forever to finish those games. But, uh, yeah, I really appreciate you guys tuning in to the strategy. I hope it helps you. And if it did help you, please leave me a comment down in the box about uh, how far you got or send me a YouTube uh, video uh, with your gameplay. I'll be sure to look at it to see how far you've gotten in zombies. And uh, there's more videos and games coming soon from me. I'm not going anywhere. I'm uh, definitely working on getting better at commentary. I'm getting better at talking to the mic. And I'm trying to get better at video editing and everything in general with, you know, dealing with this YouTube thing. And uh, so, yeah, thanks, guys. I really do appreciate it. And I will see you online. Thank you very much.